amid concerns over delays in the delivery of the first LCA Mark 1A fighter jet to the Indian Air Force. Hindustan Aeronautics Limited is now aiming to provide the first plane later this year. Significantly, the delays in the overall delivery schedule are likely to get addressed in some manner as the American engine maker GE has assured to start the supply of its GE 404 engines by September-October this year. As there is a further delay of a few months in the delivery of F404 engines by General Electric, HL is now preparing a backup to install used engines. Subsequently, delivery of the first Tejas Mark 1A to the Indian Air Force, now aimed for November, looks highly unlikely. The aircraft was first planned to be delivered to the Indian Air Force by February-March timeframe this year. But the schedule has been shifting for one reason or the other. The Indian Air Force is keen that it should get a completely integrated aircraft with all important specifications given by it. Top Indian Air Force brass including the Chief of Air Staff himself have been closely monitoring the progress made in this prestigious project. The HL carried out the first flight of the fighter a couple of months ago. The overall delivery program of the 83 LCA Mark 1As ordered initially has been delayed by many months already due to delays in the supply of GE 404 engines by Americans as they had other high priority projects. Now the American manufacturer has assured to start supplying one or two engines every month from September October this year. Hello and welcome to News Affairs. Before we proceed further, we request our viewers to please subscribe this channel if you have not yet subscribed. If you find the video informative, please like and share the video. The indigenous fighter aircraft induction into the force will be a major step in realizing self-reliance in the military sector. The LCA Mark 1A project was conceptualized after Prime Minister Narendra Modi took charge. One order worth Rs 48,000 crore for 83 planes has already been placed and another one expected to be worth Rs 65,000 crore is going to be placed for 97 planes by the end of this financial year. The Defence Ministry has already issued a tender to Hindustan Aeronautics Limited for the purchase of 97 Made in India LCA Mark 1A fighter jets. This tender is the largest order for indigenous military ever to be placed by the Indian government. Government officials had informed that this program aims to replace the Indian Air Force's fleet of MiG-21s, MiG-23s and MiG-27s which have either been phased out or are scheduled for phase out soon. Backed by both the Defence Ministry and Air Headquarters, the indigenous fighter aircraft program is expected to significantly boost indigenization efforts and provide substantial business opportunities for small and medium enterprises engaged in the defence sector across the country. In end June, a GE Aerospace spokesperson had said that the aerospace industry continues to experience unprecedented supply chain pressures. GE Aerospace is working with HAL and suppliers to resolve constraints and deliver F404 IN20 engines. Manufacturing of the jets is underway at Hindustan Aeronautics Limited and while there were other supply chain issues, the primary holdup is the engine delay. Even if some number of engines are delivered in the next few months, small batch of jets can still be delivered within short time frame. For Indian Air Force, the delay is alarming as the Tejas is going to constitute a bulk of the Indian Air Force fighter jet fleet in the next few decades and key to arresting the fighter squadron strength from going below 30 squadrons in the near term and will subsequently increase the strength. Once delivered, this would eventually make 180 Tejas Mark 1A jets and 220 jets of the Mark 1 variant available with the Indian Air Force. The combined cost of 180 Mark 1As is an estimated 1.15 lakh crores. In addition, a larger and more capable Tejas Mark II is under development, which will be powered by the General Electric F414 engines. A deal to license manufacture of the F414 engines in India is in advanced stages. As of now, the Indian Air Force has committed to procuring around 120 Tejas Mark II variants. 
Expectation is that at least one Tejas Mark 1A jet is delivered by the end of this year and half a squadron or 8 to 9 jets by the end of this fiscal year. Jai Hind!